And welcome back. We are just feeding our last rebels, and that's that. Wonderful. We have also our colony back, which is beautiful. Everybody likes having colonies back. We also have, for some reason, quite a big revolt risk, which is weird. Tax modifier. Trade modifier. Well, <laughs> we kind of only have taxes, so taxes it is. Fuck. <sighs> Smallpox, stop it! It's just smallpox. Stop being yourself, please. Please. Now we can get some pikemen. And that's our last thing done there. Beautiful. Send them down to the coast because, as we all know, the coast is beautiful and we might as well have our troops have a bit of a rest until our next reform. <laughs> Gaining 6.1 a year, which shouldn't take too long. Please don't be Portugal. <laughs> <laughs> I could technically check, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It isn't a Brazil trade now, so that would be part of Brazil. Not sure if it is though. We could technically cheat and just turn off Terra Gugnitum, but but that's no fun. Oh, our rebels disappeared instantly. That was strange. Oh well, let's see if we can't decrease some autonomy somewhere. We can't. Well, that's strange. We already have four autonomy, so everything is at zero. Wow, that decreased really quickly. Well, this does go down like extremely fast, but huh? Yeah, it goes down by 0 0.2 month, which is a lot. Wow. Hmm. <laughs> well, that's very nice. That's very nice indeed. All right, we also have money, which is good. And what do we have here? Now we'll just tow it ourselves which means we will build ourselves trade modifiers. Just the ones that we actually need to uh, suppose. Where are the trade places? Where are the trade things? Where is the stuff that involves trade, please? Please tell me, please, please. Uh, nothing there, nothing there, nothing here, nothing here. Just for two, it seems, I. The one down here it is. Oh, and that's it actually. I oh, would have expected more. Almost done with that last first cop. That colony. 999. Are you kidding me? Anyway, colony done. In that case, I'll start moving north or south. I don't know. Uh, we did want to have this colony up here, didn't we? Mm, I suppose we can do that. Was. Then once he's there, we'll just pull him back and put him into Antagansa? Anton? Anton Faganza. I don't know. It's something. And send some people here. Our general died, which is interesting, I suppose. Could have been worse. Woohoo! Now we have people coming here too. Grain is now being produced. Not the most useful of things, but I suppose we can deal with that. <laughs> We're down to zero autonomy. It's just like, holy crap. More stability. More money. Stability. Stability is good right now because we're going to be using up so much of it for these last two reforms. And they'll come pretty close to each other as well. 
Also, let's make a template. Since we can only make spearmen, it doesn't really matter what we call it. So we'll just make it 10,000 spearmen. And we'll put them in Cusco. Because Cusco, we have actually have 45,000 troops. In which case, let's make another troopage, troopage, troopage stuff. Another mass of troops right here. Yeah, why not? That was simple enough. And now we have a problem that we might be able to have this problem. Hmm. It's a bit less than zero, which means we have to raise it to at least two before we do our reform. Well, that's alright, I suppose. Could definitely be worse. Hmm. <laughs> this is the boring part of the Inca campaign. It's all going to be colonizing and stuff like that. Occasional revolts. 43%. We're getting pretty close to that. Next reform. Ah! We discovered some land. I'll go down into this later on because the closer we can get to cutting the Europeans out of South America, Chile, and Argentina. Yeah, Argentina. The better great advisor has been killed by age. Damn bad aging. The happiness among the merchants. Let's give them day one. Oh, in this case, I'll. Ooh, what do I do? Colapio. Should have probably checked if that was. The fuck? Where is it? Oh, here. Oh, I don't mind that at all. It's abandoned this colony. There's no point for that. Instead, let's spread this one over these two. So I couldn't I couldn't actually colonize that myself. That's pretty good. Did want to go down here first anyway. So I'm pretty pleased about that. We can get oh right, the military reform. We can do it now because we can have a lot of leftover points. Can we actually upgrade our spearmen? Yes we can. And let's go for... See, we have no fire at all. Uh, let's go for this one, I suppose. Slingshots. Or we can do it, like, as it's supposed to be. It's just like... Now we'll do mountain warriors, because... Hell, all of where we are right now is mountains. Well, at least our mainland is. Don't question me. I know what I'm talking about. Kind of, maybe. Good. Let's send our next guy down here. And make another call. Beautiful. I might be able to fast track us if I make um, myself... Wait, wait, do we have to have a core? No western neighbors with core provinces boarding our core. Yeah, we do need cores, so we'd have to finish the... Jeez. Natives. Calm down. Getting a population. Ah. This place seems to be very popular. Don't mind if I do. All our advisors are dying. Prestige, I don't need missionary strength. And we'll go for discipline. Not bad. Why are we losing money suddenly? We were drinking money before. Huh? The dead? Oh, I thought you said the dead demand recompense. I'm like, what? The dead? What are you on about? Although what I think we can do is just turn off all our forts. At this point, it honestly does not matter. Where is the button? To turn off all my forts. There was a button somewhere. This is annoying. There should be a button right here. Okay... I suppose I'll have to do it manually. That's... strange. That's very strange indeed. Well, there we go. Manually. Manually. What a disgusting thing to do. This place is gaining population like crazy. Oh, it does have a massive um, population here as well, and since they're so low in terms of aggressiveness and ferocity, they're much more likely to join us. 
So I'm quite happy about that. I don't see why one wouldn't be. After all. I will send these two together. And I turned out the force the fort in Cusco already. Send this guy to Pira and give him another ten thousand just there as well. Can reform ten thousand, can I? Ah, uh, well, I can do it. Sure, why not? <laughs> I'll be above a force limit by two, but that won't be much of a deal. That's like one or two colonies. Does make us lose a bit of money, but there's worse things that happen. This thing again. No, uh, actually. Ita. Oops, that's Ira. Itapua is this one here. I suppose. No, I'll send it to this one first. I want to get more down than across for now. Oh, fine, I'll disband it too. Simply because it's costing us quite a bit of money. <laughs> yeah, also that's the fact that we have free free advisors and we really don't need free advisors. Ah, how great a second colonist right now would be. It would be great, I tell you. So good. Still, we've got quite a quite an expanse right now. Forty-five out of forty-five. We can't build any ships. Oh, stop being such annoying things. Again, this thing. What do I want now? Corentus, Chapio. I want to finish this thing. Whatever. I can't afford any more. Um, what's it called? Colonies. So I'll have to do for now. These, I can't get them, which is actually really <laughs> annoying to me. I want myself some islands. Islands, please. Island, Island, Island. Oh. Basic financial instruments, I suppose. Yes, we have definitely got Portugal on our side. Abandoned mounds. We're trying to explore. Portugal, can we, like, say hello to you, please? No, he can't. Uh, that's mean. That's quite nice. And you don't even have to ask for us to, like, let you through. I feel slightly... annoyed, I suppose, because... I mean, I've been doing that all the time recently, but... I mean, if you colonize, you can... As long as you have yourself a uh, conquistador, you can walk through the lands of the natives. Which you can claim isn't the nicest thing to do. But then again, I'll put this guy down here. Then we'll send our colonist back to Yare Yare Ru. Yaru, Yayu. I don't know what these faces are called. And one more down and we're actually at our important center of trade, which is great. And we'll have a Chile trade node, or whatever it's called. Patagonia, Patagonia, alright, that's fair enough. We will ignore the corruption, because we have so much of it already. I'll decrease it twice. 86, come on guys. Shouldn't take us much longer, of course. We guess, oh, we're still at 49. Now they need military access. Wait, that means we have discovered them. No, we don't. How come they can ask us to do things and we can't see them? That's... That's quite rude. They've insulted us. Why did you insult us? They want all our provinces. <laughs> we are so fucked. They want all our provinces. But... Why? Why? What, what did we ever do to you? What the hell? That's such bullshit. <laughs> 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 
Well, that's the end of that timer, and I'll be seeing you next time. Hope you enjoyed, and let's hope the Portuguese don't destroy us with, like, 9,000 troops. They only have 16,000. Oh, see you next time. Hope you enjoyed.